game over. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel and this is going to be a new series that we're starting. It's going to be Red Dead Redemption 2. We're going to be playing the story of Arthur Morgan and his journey through the Wild West with the Dutch Vandalin gang. And we'll also meet John Marston in it who was in Red Dead Redemption 1. Uh, amazing uh, game. Yeah, so uh, like I was saying, uh, this is Red Dead Redemption 2. This is the Wild West. Uh, let's see what adventures Arthur Morgan and the Dutch Vandalin gang get up to. If you like the video, please like, subscribe and share. And we'll catch you on the next one. Peace! By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. Yeah, what I, was, what I was basically saying is, try not to play online because it wasn't as good as I don't think it's improved. America was becoming a land of laws. Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Rockstar Games presents... Presents... <laughs> presents... Red Dead Redemption 2. story of Arthur Morgan. Winter is here! Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know, an old man in town, bandits, it ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Yeah! It looks like a brutal storm is coming. Well, he's already there. Chapter 1, Coulter. I don't know if we'll be doing this in chapters, depending on how long it takes, but, yeah. We might just do it in sections. Bring him in here! Gaskell, get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. Yes, just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen, listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny. Sean, Mac, 
They might be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I can throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it. Gladly. Bullshit. You'd rather but be dead than alive. We are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Dutch man. Everybody, Not the we're Morgan. safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. No, we are Come not. On, Arthur. All right. We've got some work to do. We ain't run into them yet. So they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey. I ain't had time to ask. You. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey. You need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. We need you strong. Old X match speed with Dutch. Okay. Go. Come on. Let's go. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Have to ride faster. Here. Use our one to slow the horse down. How slow do you want to go? It's not fucking moving. I think our one just a dead fucking stop. Screw the language. The beast. Hey, they're probably put you swearing up in it. Can't see you back there. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. In a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. And what about the money? Please tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. But we sure can't go back there to collect it anytime soon. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Gentlemen, found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. It sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or. <laughs> Was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. Yeah. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen 
Double tap and hold about pushing forward. You run into anybody else? I I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Ain't much, shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No, like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Right. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Uh, thanks. Okay. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Easy. Okay. Let's head down there. Health is displayed in the lower left corner, okay. So we got quite health. The answer bar shows the remaining health, the level that is acquired, which is how quick your health refills. Okay, so we need a full heart for it to regen quicker. Let's hitch up here. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Someone's having fun in there. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of you. Okay, press how to take cover. Yep. I said the cattle shed, Arthur. <laughs> right, so Alfred's crouch. Arthur, take cover in that shed over there. <laughs> Hello. Peek. Shut up, Billy. Excuse me. Hello! Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. He's out to check on my guy. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks, Arthur, dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. I just Arthur, need some cause the body of food in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen, keep your eyes on Dutch. Hold out one to show weapon wheel. Uh, okay. So we've got a cattleman revolver, we've got a knife, we got a fist. Buddy. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Hold out to, to aim. I am kind of desperate. Hey.
<laughs> no prisoners. See if we can turn up the um, brightness on this because it's quite dark. Okay, sharpness is as high as it goes. Right, so we'll leave that for that. See how it goes. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials: food, medicine, whiskey. Okay. Your strength's up for the ride back. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw it. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Mike found a dead body in the wagon outside. The place is dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horse. Okay, found some premium cigarettes, a card. Okay, looks like it's a cigarette collecting card. Something that, uh... I wish I had a lantern. Do we have a lantern? No, we don't. a way to get over to him. Search the chest. Uh, is there no way to get up there? What are you doing in there, Arthur? I'm searching. Stop your bitching. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah? You search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. So 
So at the minute we're neutral. At the minute that is. here near the light what are you bastards doing why are you up here we're fixing to rob some train gonna blow the tracks i don't know more than that i swear <laughs> well i would say it looks like you have this arthur do what you want with him i don't care but bring that horse when you're done oh. Do we <laughs> Shall we beat him? <laughs> We've got you gone. Alright, where's my gun? Alright, there it is. My goddamn hit. Bit, so I suppose it's better than nothing. with us. Of course. Yes. It's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. So, yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Get on. Uh, we'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I, he. Ah, uh, wow. My husband. Hey, somebody's coming. 
Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, might have found a homestead, but we weren't the first. Comb O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. <laughs> And that's going to be it for this first episode of Red Dead Redemption. Winter is here. If you like the video, please like, subscribe and share. And we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.